shot, old half guard, popped up and then took him over. He's going to add that right on the end here. Okay, so instead of popping out, instead of running him over, okay, if you're finding you're not getting deep enough, all right, so you hit that pyramid, they're staying too, staying too high on your shoulders and your head. Okay, I don't want to just sit there. I don't want to let them start working, especially no gi. Right, start pulling on my arms, pulling on my neck, all that fun stuff. Okay. I just had to get down here. Falling down hard sometimes. All right, so get my underhook. Stop the throw. He runs. Right? He's too high. If I try and sit out, now I'm not gonna be able to get my head out. You know what I mean? With that elbow, all his weight's on that side. Right? So instead, I'm just gonna sit through, do my pyramid forward into half guard. Pull him up, loading him up, all right, and then I pop up to my knee. So now I'm back in my dog fight, but I got his leg this time. Cool? And then you can take whatever takedown you like in here. You don't know any, we just run him over, okay? If you want to drive in, you got another seek up, take him the other way, lift arm out, pull him over, your choice. If all that sounds like Greek, just do what I did, and run him over. Okay, the goal is to get him back to his back, and then it's his turn. Unless you have to stop and address it. Right. And then it's John's turn. And it's like, cool. My voice gets funny. He starts to come up and I spin. Alright? Try to keep this underhook around the leg. Alright? So he can pull me in. Alright? Switch to the seat. Pops up to his knees. The more you can do that in transition, the less work it's going to be. Less likely I'm going to switch it. Alright? So try to go in a slow, Steady pace so that it stays somewhat fluid, okay? Try not to go position, stop. Position, stop, okay? Because then you're going to get into that rhythm, right? Where you kind of get find yourself getting smushed, your face is on the ground, you're flattened out. We don't want to end up in that position. The whole point is to use our momentum against it. Cool? And John runs me over. And then as he's setting up, so am I. I've already got my frames. Cool? So, you guys want to see the second half and then we can put it together? Or do you guys remember it from a couple weeks ago? What's that? Sure. We'll just know from Sandy. Since that's where we did it, that's all right. Okay, so same thing. I shoot, he sprawls, but this time instead of trying to pyramid out, I'm just going to step up and sit my hips in. All right, so as he's falling, I'm using his momentum to come up to my knees. Reaching past with my underhook, not pulling him in. Here. <laughs> cool? Without a person, I shoot, he sprawls, I toast and pull him in. So as he falls, I can switch my legs, come up to my knees. Got it? Let's just do that part. Alright, off the shot. Sit through, pop up to your knees in that dog fight position. And then we'll put it all together later. Got it? One, two, three.